I'm, I'm motivated by fear. It's fear of fear. I hate being scared to do something. It's very simple. This is what I believe, and I'm willing to die for it. In my mind, I, I was always afraid. My whole life, I was afraid. But I had this fucking voice, this, this conscience, that would always be battling me and say, hey, you got to get up and do something. You put water into a bottle, it becomes the bottle. You put it in a teapot, it becomes the teapot. And the shit haunted me. Or it can crash in water, my friend. And that voice that I talked about, it kept talking louder and louder and louder. The first rule of success is to have a vision. Before anybody else in the world believes it, is you have to believe it. There's no reason to have a plan B because it distracts from plan A. And I decided to make moves. The world ain't all sunshine and rainbows. It's a very mean and nasty place, and I don't care how tough you are, it will beat you to your knees and keep you there permanently if you let it. You, me, or nobody is going to hit as hard as life. But it ain't about how hard you hit. It's about how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward. How much you can take and keep moving forward. That's how winning is done. The task is the future. It's always one grip. The separation of talent and skill is one of the, 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 the greatest misunderstood concepts for people who are trying to excel, who have dreams and want to do things. Talent you have naturally. Skill is only developed by hours and hours and hours of beating on your craft. Well, in any fight, it's the guy, women and guy, who go win that inch. But you gotta be willing to take the hits and not point your finger saying you ain't where you want to be because of him or her or anybody. Cowards do that and that ain't you. you. Stay here. You're better than that. Out of us. Or we can fight our way back. He who says he can and he who says he can't are both usually right. Yeah, I'm an athlete, a warrior. We should already be, always be ready to fight everybody on our worst day. How greatness is not this wonderful, superb, elusive, godlike creature that only the special among us will ever take. It's something that truly exists in all of us. It's a difficult motherfucker where you're going to fail and you're going to be in your head. You're going to be saying, I'm not good enough. And it's how you get through that. It's how you get through that on a daily basis. On a daily basis. It can't be done. I heard it can't You can be whatever you want to be. You can do whatever you want to do. But when you start doubting yourself, that's very dangerous. Where you going? You tell yourself the truth. The fucking truth. It's life, man. Take it for what it's worth and change it. I can't go. I, I can't go any faster. You judge your brain. You can your brain. You can your pain. Comfort, suffering, all the words that we hate to say because we have this happy, peaceful world we live now. We stop. We slow down. And if you can get to these different barriers and gain 5%, 2%, 3%, that 40% becomes 60. That 60% becomes 70, 80, and 90. And then you'll hopefully one day near 100. Don't do the two of the naysayers. When they say it's impossible, I heard it is 